I've got the plum assignment this morning, well, at least one of them. We're talking Girl Scout cookies. And uh, Shauna King joins me from the Girl Scouts of Western Ohio. Good morning, welcome. Good morning, thank you so much for having me. And thank you for bringing in all of these cookies. I hope you're gonna leave some behind. But of we course have, I am, of course I we am. We have a couple of new additions this year, don't we? We do have a couple of new additions as opposed to um, our, just our regular traditional right, cookie like sale. Right, like one of my favorites, the Samoas right yes, here. Yes, and one of my favorites too is the Thin Men's, so mm -hmm. popular seller. But we do have two new additions this year. We have our Girl Scout snack bars. Um, we have two varieties of Girl Scout snack bars. We have our um, tagalongs, which are drizzled in chocolate and has peanut butter peanut chips. Butter, and we have our double Dutch chocolate, uh, our double Dutch snack bars, which are drizzled in chocolate and has chocolate chips. These are perfect for on the go snacking and they're packed full of wholesome ingredients such as, you know, um, rolled oats, um, crispy cereal flakes and chewy granola. It's our healthier option. It's a really good idea. Yes, it is. Hoping um, you guys stick to your New Year's resolution. Well, actually I've been on one and uh, those are good alternatives, but it's really going to be hard not to eat every variety of Girl Scout cookies. Well, there's the best no shame in that. <laughs> they're, the, they're the best cookies on the planet. Thank you so much. Yeah. And this will let you know our cookies are three fifty a box, okay. and our snack bars are $4 a box. And girls are currently in the neighborhoods right now taking cookie orders, and they will do so all the way up until March 17th. Now, when they come to my door, I always have to give them some money just because, uh, well, I love the Girl Scouts and I love the cookies, but what's the money used for? The money is used for all kinds of things. After the cost of cookies, the proceeds do go to um, different activities the girls can participate in, and the troops do get proceeds from every box of cookie that is sold. And the girls can do with the proceeds whatever they want to, because Girl Scouts is girl-led, and they can use it to find good, fun activities and, or go to Girl Scout programs, go on a fun trip, or use it for community service projects. Mm. Well, it doesn't get any better than that. Mm -hmm. um, so your favorite are the Thin Mints? Yes, they're my Thin Mints, and I really love the Samoas as well. But they're all yeah, fantastic in their, all, in their own way. They are. They are just terrific. Well, Shauna King, thank you so much thank for Thank you so much for in. having me. And uh, folks, yeah, please uh, don't say no when the Girl Scouts <laughs> come to your door. I know diet-wise you may want to, but uh, support them and uh, enjoy your cookies.